Hey, welcome back to the channel, folks and folkettes. Today, it's the last game of the season. We are finally here, folks. And it's going to be hype. I mean, I mean, I know we got the World Series in full swing, but Basel 9 playoffs were just getting started. You know, we wanted to delay the playoffs a little bit to not interfere with uh, everything that's going on in the World Series. Uh, before we get too far into it, before we get too far into the game, though, let me know below in the comments, who, what is your pick? Who are you picking to win the World Series? It's 2-1 series, Phillies up 2-1 against the Astros, which uh, might actually change uh, when you're watching this video, but as of, as of today... They are up 2-1. We got another game tonight. I mean, Bryce Harper absolutely carrying the Phillies. Personally, I got the Phillies 4-2 series. All right. It could be close, but after that, though, be sure to tune into Baseball 9 World right here on this channel because we are headed into the playoffs with the Padres taking a commanding lead first seed. Absolute domination of the regular season headed into the post-game, post-season playoffs. Um, number one seed, by far the favorites to win it all. So, here we go. Last game of the season and The great, I love this because we're also going to be able to see the season summary. All the stats uh, that were comp compiled this season. Is that going to be a home run? Yes, sir. It's going to clear the wall. Two-run home run, 385. This team, I'll tell you what, this team has been doing phenomenal this season. Most of the guys batting over 400. We're going to see how we just absolutely clowned on the rest of this league. And the ball is going to go all the way back. And that's going to be a nice... Oh, not a triple. Not a triple. He's too slow. He's too slow. This ballpark is too small for that to be counted down as a triple. And that's going to be the first out of the ball game. Maybe, no, second out. All right, got a big speedster. Can he get a triple now? We're, we're headed. Look at how, he's almost going to overlap him. He's all the way to third. And we score one. That's the triple. See, I'm telling you, the difference between normal fast at elite 236 speed. You saw right there. All right, 236. He's able to get that triple easy. But with 120 thrown out at third. Here, we're going to clobber one over to right field line. Down the line. And that's going to be a line drive for zero. This game's over. The last game of the season over before it even started. Mike Trout's about to go off. That's another base hit. Threatening to score. Let's see if Otani can send these guys home. A three-run shot would be absolutely amazing right now. The fastball. Oh, yes, sir. That's gone. It's sky high. 394 45 degree launch 45 degrees launch that one to the moon shot to the moon finally we're getting some home run action that's probably the that's a moon shot if i've ever seen one and that's gonna be it for the starters see you later it's nice knowing you buddy oh that's a home run i thought that's gonna be fouled off it's going to land Justin. Can we get a replay? Otani, that's the second of the day, but I thought that one was going to be fouled, but I guess the ball curves back in at the last second. Otani, last game of the season, is making a statement telling the Angels if they're not in a position, make the playoffs next season. He is going to the Padres. He has taken his talents to San Diego, 100 miles south of L.A., and he is no longer going to be associated with this ball club. <laughs> with that said, though, we're going to put up another run here with two outs. Machado 9-0. The Padres wish they were doing this well in the real playoffs. Just blowing through teams. Easy, easy money. Mike Trout takes one down low. Lifts it up. 403. Another home run today. He's batting 515 now. Otani's back. Last time, snuck one by right field. This time, he's not going to have the distance. It's going to be called an out on the field. 
Out at home, Machado out at home. Give me a replay. No, I don't believe these close calls. Baseball line umps worse, worse than MLB umps, worse than NFL refs even. The absolute opposite of cream of the crop. I demand a replay. I demand this league to give me a written explanation of why he was called out. He's clearly safe. Gone. Take the fastball. That's how you do it. That's a home run. 406. Second home run of the day. Man, we are just piling on now. 15 to 1. Hit by pitch. Their pitcher can't even believe what's going on. And they have to resort to injuring us to try to win. But it's not even close. So that's going to be it for today. Padre 17. Reapers won end of the regular season. But stay tuned for more. Look at the post game. Look at the season stats. And uh, us progressing on into the playoffs. So if you're just new around here. We're going to go ahead and advance and look at our stats. Remember guys. You, you earn. You also earn. Rewards for being the top, I think, three or four in each statistical category. So, just a quick rundown of, you know, what you get at the end of each season. After the last ball game of each season, I'll tell you the standings. So, we came in first place. Um, top four make the playoffs. So, here are the regular season stats. 0.9171 percentage, 154 and 14. Last 10, 10 and 0 ERA. 2.519 ERA team batting average 4.78. You got lots of stats. We <laughs> over what? 2,000 runs, 3,000 hits, 1,000 doubles, 100 triples, 569 home runs, which is probably more than the rest of these teams combined. Um, errors, strikeouts. Not that many strikeouts actually. But if we look at batting top nine, all my players batting average. Absolute domination with Mike Trout ending up at a 514 clip. Um, hits us as well. At pretty much every most statistical categories. Oh, Juan Soto lacking on the doubles, but triples too. 60 triples, Juan Soto. The reason he was lacking on doubles is he made up. He was just hitting triples. I mean, the rest of this league. Okay, he has 60 by himself. He probably has more than the rest of my team combined. How's the rest of the entire league combined? All right, in the entire rest of the league, there's one player with, just kidding, a couple players with two triples, and most everyone else has one. And Juan Soto has 60. Home runs. Pro 4 ends up with 106. Oh, Otani. One shy of 199. Uh, Juan Soto lagging in the home run department. But Jones, 31. Come on. RBI, yeah, not even close. Uh, what other stats we got? Strikeouts. Wins above replacement. RC, 27. That's all crazy. Pitching, though. ERA, Otani finishes the season with 0.97. You guys already saw that. Wins, losses, most of my pitchers undefeated. Saves, not a lot of saves because we, we're not getting in much save uh, scenarios. Strikeouts though, Tani, 351 on this season. No one else is even close, almost triple the next closest. So this is uh, just the domination. But if you guys haven't seen, I actually, Manuel played a full perfect season. And the stats on that team were were even crazier. We had, we had dudes over 700 batting average. Um, just insane, insane stats, but you get a look at the stats and now, all right, top three in each statistical category, batting average, RBIs, home runs, and stolen bases. So batting average, top four, all over 500 RBIs, almost over 300 home runs. Yep. Easy money, stolen bases. I got to do that better, but Juan Soto with the speed, I mean, 236 speed, he can steal bases like no other and the title holder slash pitcher. See, look, yeah four categories and then you get coins if they're in the top three so no one's first in saves because 99 percent of the time my starting pitch would go full nine innings so that's the only thing you miss out on but otani 32 wins darvish 31 wins era otani 0.97 strikeouts otani 351 obviously the league mvp if you had to vote comment down below who's the mvp uh, of my team is either otani on the on the pitching side of things or i don't know mike trout maybe on the batting side of things but otani did pretty well as a batter as well so 
these are the rewards that we get from winning the season. Sometimes you get lucky, you get some other stuff in there, but not too good for now. But here's the big money, though, the coins. Remember, you get first place in the league, you get hundreds of thousands of coins, and these are going to be important. You're going to want these, and you get a ton extra for being top three. And we advance now to the postseason. You win the postseason, you, get, you, you advance in the next league, so playoffs. We are uh, going up against the fourth seed fighters. All your stats get reset as well in the playoffs. Um, championship series, it's uh, best of fives in the first round, best of sevens in the championship series, and then the, all the stats get reset for the postseason. So, guys, be sure to tune in. Stay tuned. We're going through the postseason. It's coming up quick. You're not going to want to miss it, but that's all we got for today. As we said, we're in Legend 2 League, so we win this. We're up to Legend 1, and then next stop, World Championships. Let's go, baby. Get subscribed. Turn on those notifications. MLB World Series coming up. Baseball 9 World Series, even better. Don't miss out. Thanks for watching. Peace.